Hey guys! So today I am doing a monthly favorites video. Um, it's just a bunch of random things that I've liked in April, not May, April. Um, and yeah, so the first item that I've been obsessed with, like you seeing it every single day <laughs> and just being in love with it, is this Nivea Free Time Body Wash. I think it's called Free Time. Free Time Body Wash. It's supposed to be really really um hydrating which I need because I have really really dry skin um especially no you know what all year round all year round I have dry skin it's horrible and it makes my legs like really really itchy and irritated when I shave them so um I shave with this sometimes and it's amazing um <clears throat> and it just smells so good it's supposed to be star fruit I don't know what star fruit smells like I've had it before like ate it before but it doesn't smell like this, in my opinion. Um, but it smells so like fruity. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like a to like I've never smelled a fruity scent that smells like this. It smells so good, um, and it's just really good for your skin, really hydrating, and it makes your skin really soft. So I love this body wash, and it's like super cheap. I think it was like under five dollars. So really cheap, really big bottle. I've used it for like a month and a half now. So I really love this. Okay, so my next favorite are these plugs. Um, I got them like two weeks ago, I think. And I've been wearing these white um, solid, I think they were acrylic plugs for like a, like quite a few weeks. And they were very heavy on my ears and my ears hurt when um, like I would lay down or like anytime my ear would get pressed on, it would hurt. Like even just the slightest touch. And I think it's because the plugs were just so heavy on my ears that it just really irritated my ears. And I taped my ears like to stretch them, but like when I put my plug in, it just barely fit. So I think I did like a little bit of stretching with that plug too. And I think it really irritated my ears. So I bought some steel tunnels and they're double flared and they are so comfortable. It feels like I'm not even wearing anything at all. Like it just feels so light and like nothing. Um, and they are one inch. Because I am one inch now, but they are just so like, it feels like nothing. It feels so good, and I think they look really pretty. Um, my ears are starting to stick out now because my ears are getting big now, so it's a little bit scary. But <laughs> but I really do like these plugs, and I got them off of eBay. I have no idea. I'll put the link below where I got them. Um, they were super cheap. I think they were like fifteen dollars around there, which in my opinion is really cheap because stores here they sell for like 20 bucks each like plus like they could be even more um and they didn't have ones like this but anyways um i really like them they're super comfortable super light and awesome my next favorite is this it is model in a bottle makeup setting spray it looks like this sorry if you can't really see it it's a it's a it's kind of a weird bottle um this stuff I got quite a while ago and I hated it because it smells so perfumey and it just like, in my opinion, it like stings my eyes. Even if my eyes are closed for like a really long time and I open them, my eyes still sting. Um, but it really, really makes your makeup stay for so long and make it look like flawless for like the whole time. It literally is like hairspray for your face. It's amazing. Um, yes, it does smell really perfumey like really really perfumey um and I usually go with like MAC Fix Plus or like the Makeup Forever spray which I don't really like but stuff like that like just like liquidy no scent um or subtle scent and just very subtle um and those ones are more for like a dewy finish the model of bottle is like a matte finish spray so when you spray this on your skin's gonna be matte and it's gonna your makeup's gonna stick to your face like until you scrub it off so I mean it does have a horribly strong scent and I mean I have to close my eyes for like a good minute before I can open them because it does hurt my eyes it's just very strong and it's like right in your face um but it's like when you spray perfume in your face and you're like oh god but um yeah if you just spray it on your face wait like a like a few minutes and then open your eyes, it'll be okay. I have really sensitive eyes though, so that might just be me. But, um, it works really, really well. And I only use this for special occasions, like if I'm going to an event or like night out or something like that, that's when I would use this. I wouldn't use this on a regular day-to-day -day basis because it's fairly expensive and it 
like it's really like it's strong so <laughs> be prepared to make that your perfume because you're not gonna be able to spill your perfume over that because it's just so strong okay so last for beauty is this amber blush golden shimmer body souffle I mentioned this in my bronzing video or my fake tan collection video or something like that um, and it's just a little jar it's from Bath and Body Works and it smells heavenly it smells so amazing and it's just like a shimmery bronzy body lotion um, and I like to use this on more special occasions like nights um, I'm definitely gonna be using it a lot more in the summer but I just like to put it on my arms like my chest like depending on what I'm wearing like a dress or something like that um, my legs and it will just make you look like really luminous all over your body and just really really pretty and just add a little bit of color to your skin not even like it's not gonna stain your skin it's not gonna make you look orange it just adds like a hint of like a glow to your skin which is really really beautiful and I like it a lot okay so last but not least I'm gonna just quickly mention two TV shows that I recommend um, these aren't really favorites of the month but they are like favorites of my life <laughs> and I didn't just start watching them last month like I've been watching them for a long time but I kind of was just like I need to mention this in a video so I'm just gonna put it in my favorites because they are favorites of mine not necessarily in April but just in general uh, so the first one is Bob's Burgers I just have the first season on DVD because my boyfriend got it for me because he knows I love it so much and I think it was fairly cheap this show is so underrated it's ridiculous it, it's such an amazing like I literally like when it was like showing previews to when it first started I was like I need to watch this show I need to have this show in my life and I need to watch it and I've been watching it since it was on TV like yeah so it's so good like every week it's on I'm like Bob's Burgers mom put it on and she told me like the other day she's like I only like the show because you get so excited about it and I just can't help it like Louise hilarious like she has the funniest voice so funny and she's like secretly evil which is hilarious well she's not secretly evil but you know what I mean um Louise is the one with the bunny ears um and then friggin Tina I painted actually a picture of her like a while ago um and she's just like sexual and <laughs> so funny and awkward um and my favorite is probably the mom because she's just so like da -da 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 -da, like all the time and hilarious like I love her so much and how much she like teases Bob and Bob just like Bob is like the main character but he is like I don't even know he's not even the main character if that makes any sense like everybody else's personalities are so much huger than Bob's and Bob is like the main character I don't know but it works so well and um I love it so much so definitely it's on Netflix so you can go watch it on Netflix um, I have it on DVD and my boyfriend's downloaded like all the seasons and it's on every Sunday at, I think like 9 or 8 or something it's in the set with like Simpsons and the Family Guy and Bob's Burgers and like all those on Sunday so and that's I have Canadian television so I don't know what it is in the States but that's what it is for me and I'm always really excited on Sunday because I'm like Bob's Burgers is on <laughs> so yeah I love Bob's Burgers Okay, so last but not least, definitely not least, I don't have a DVD for it, unfortunately. <laughs> I will, I don't even know, leave a link, who knows. Um, but is the show Dexter. Now, I watched this show about two years ago. And when it was two years ago, it was, I watched like, I think it was in like the fifth or the sixth season. And then they did the seventh season and I watched that one, like I watched it each week. Um, and it was on Showtime. Now, I did watch it a while ago, obviously, so whatever. I rewatched it a couple months ago and now my dad just started watching it. So <laughs> that's why I'm kind of including it in here because I was like, why haven't I ever talked about Dexter? <laughs> like that show well the light just came in that show is my life like I cannot live without that show like if I could erase anything from my memory it would be Dexter so I could watch it again and I always say that because I seriously wish I could erase it from my memory so I could watch it all over again and just like re-fall in love with the whole thing because it's just so amazing and 
like my dad's watching it now and I want to watch it again like that's how amazing it is like I could just watch it over and over and over again and there were so many seasons there was there were seven seasons so it's like you kind of forget the beginning seasons once you get all the way down to like the seventh season unless you like literally watch it for 24 hours every day seven days and then finish it at whatever time you can um but like you forget you kind of forget what happens and stuff like that so then you just want to watch it right over again like right after it's done it's so good my boyfriend and i watched it together i got my dad watching it now so it's just i can't even describe how amazing it is if you haven't heard about dexter um i'm sure you could watch a trailer or something like that but it's pretty much about a killer and he is the main character and my dad didn't want to watch the show because it was about a killer and he's like i'm not watching a show about a killer i thought my door was open uh, i'm not gonna watch a show about a killer because like that's totally inappropriate and i don't want to watch like a gory show about a killer like it, like that shouldn't be um i don't know like made famous a person that's a killer on a show like that's just not right and I was like, no, Dad, he only kills bad people. Like, you have to watch the show. It's so good. He, he's not, like, a killer. He has rules. He has everything like that. Like, you need to watch it. And he started watching it, and he's like, I need to watch this show all the time. So every time he comes home from work, he watches it. But um, the show is pretty much about a killer, and he has sets of rules um, told by his father that he can only kill people that are killers. So he kills killers, pretty much. So... If he finds out that somebody is a killer, he will, like, hunt them down and kill them. And it's so good because it's, like, he has that life, like, that little separate life. But then he has a whole other life that he lives as a um, forensic scientist. Forensic scientist? Forensic? I don't know. He's in forensics. And he does blood spatter. So I don't even know. Like, it's so good. Like, if you haven't watched it, you need to, like, get that shit in your life get a pizza and watch Dexter and just watch it. Um, it's on Dex, it's on Dexter, oh my god. <laughs> it's on Netflix, so you can watch it on there. I'm pretty sure all seven seasons are on there. Um, I'm guessing so. And yeah, so you really need to like just watch it because you just, you just have to have that in your life. Like you can't, you're, li you're living an ignorant life not watching that show. You just gotta watch it, even just the first episode. If you don't, if you watch the first episode and you don't like it, that's fine, but you just need to, like, bite the bullet, and, like, I know you're probably like, eh, I don't want to be like everybody and watch Dexter, like, everybody watches Dexter, but there's a reason why everybody watches Dexter, because it's so good, and everybody can, like, connect with it, and he is beautiful, and just the whole show is amazing, <laughs> so you really need to watch it, and yeah, side note, also, if you have Netflix, watch Breaking Bad, because that show's amazing, too, um, I guess it is one of my favorites as well, but I, I don't know, I don't want to mention too many, like, really famous shows, but yeah, I love Breaking Bad as well, so if you want to watch that show, that one's on Netflix as well, those are just two shows you really, really need to check out, Bob's Burgers as well, but that's more of, like, a casual, like, episode, each episode's different, so you don't really need to, like, tack onto a storyline. But yeah, so good, just watch all those shows, and your life will feel complete.